In this video, let's see what do you mean by the intervals in which a given function is increasing or decreasing. Now we definitely know the study about increasing decreasing functions and in this category we are going to see that if a question is given to us, a function is given to us and we have to check what are the intervals in which the function is increasing and what are the intervals in which a function is decreasing. How to go about it? That is the procedure. So the procedure says that step 1 would be that whatever the function is given to you, put it equal to fx or f of x. The second step tells me to actually find out the first derivative of this given function. That means find f dash x. Firstly, you will be given a function fx, you have to find its first derivative. Then what do you do? Then actually you have to put that f dash x greater than 0. If you put that f dash x greater than 0, two things would be there. Suppose you are asked in the question about the interval in which my given function is increasing, definitely putting f dash x greater than 0 will automatically give me increasing wala intervals only, the intervals in which the function is increasing only. But if you are asked for the decreasing intervals, the function decreasing in what intervals, whatever the remaining values are there f dash x greater than 0 gave me increasing, whatever the remaining values, whatever the remaining intervals are there, they will yield to decreasing function intervals only, got it? So basically increasing would be given by f dash x greater than 0, decreasing by the remaining values. Now even if you are not going to understand this, which is actually very much clear that only few points cannot lead to an understanding in a new concept of mathematics. Some problems are there in the next videos to make you understand this concept very much better. Stay tuned for more videos, watch the next video with the first numerical problem on the intervals on increasing and decreasing function.